What's up guys, Grim here. I apologize for not making a video over, man, the last three weeks or so, but if you had watched my last videos that I did, I was talking about I was probably about to buy a house and all that good stuff. Well, the house is bought and I'm moving into it right now. It's been so hectic trying to do this whole moving process. We still have more to move um, and all that, but we're getting it underway. Uh, and of course, I don't have the green screen up. As you can see, uh, my actual chair is right up against the wall, so it kind of sucks. I got to move around stuff around this room right now. So uh, hopefully we'll get it all lined out and be able to make videos and stuff for you guys to see. I've been really bummed out that I haven't been able to make uh, the latest Rift content on the expansion and all that. But uh, hopefully once I get settled in here we'll be able to get more of a consistent schedule and get back to playing the games that you guys like. Alright, so we're going to play some ta uh, Tavern Brawl in Hearthstone right now. And uh, I've played a few games already. Uh, I actually recorded the games and I planned on posting them but for some reason my mouse is messing up and like I, I was going for the game winning move like at the end of the game and yeah my mouse actually clicks whenever it's not supposed to and it actually screwed up my entire win at the end and I lost the game and I was so upset I just quit talking at the end of the video it sucks so bad but hopefully we'll be able to pull off a good win here and be able to uh, make a good video that isn't depressing like that one was possibly going to be because I was just like you know it was one of those moments whenever something like you have the win in the bag and you accidentally do something or whatever well my mouse is clicking the wrong buttons it's like uh, it's not acting right at all I guess I gotta get a new mouse it it really sucks or else it needs to be cleaned or something um, we went with warlock here because warlock is very good in these type of formats uh, because uh, card draw is very very important especially in a format where you can't determine your own deck so that's how this is going alright so this tavern brawl here is basically where you get to choose your class but then you choose a secondary class that you want to get uh, cards from so as you can see it pops up here and what class would we want to get cards from I would say mage mage is one of the best for individual cards like fireball frostbolt all that kind of stuff so we're gonna go ahead and go with that alright so the first card we're going to drop is our imp and this imp is actually going to give our other minions one health uh, extra each turn um, whenever we start dropping minions that is Okay, no, he is going to drop a two drop. Not good. That means that we got to probably, yeah, we got to definitely exchange here. No, we don't. Let's go ahead and attack face. Because he's the one on the ropes right now with having to try to control me. He's going to exchange here, and that means that I got two extra damage. Unless he has some card to control here. He's most likely going to exchange right here though. And that means that I wouldn't have got that uh, extra damage there if I wouldn't have attacked. Alright, so I'm not a pro at Hearthstone by any means. And most likely you're going to see plenty of instances where I forget to draw my card first before I do other stuff. Uh, because I'll play other cards and then I'll go, oh I need to draw a card because I got leftover mana and then it'll be... A bad play but um, let's go ahead and draw okay we don't have anything to play unfortunately I mean I could have dropped this uh, one right here but I, will enjoy watching you die. I don't well it would have turned out to be a good play actually so hmm all right yeah that would have been a really good play actually so let's go ahead and look for two demons. Nice. Okay, we're going past our turn. We're behind the curve now. This guy's got a 3-5 and a 1-1 one, one on board. We got a 0-1, but it's not really helping us much. So that means that we'll be able to uh, drop this. Oh, look at that. 
He turned into a hunter. Okay, so we're going to discard two cards whenever we do this, which is going to be rough. Uh, but we got to do it. Don't. Oh, that would have been such a good card. Oh, well. Got to do what we got to do. Uh, fortunately, we got other legendaries to uh, fill that gap. We have Jaraxxus and we have Nefarian. Oh, that wasn't nice. Look at all the cards he's got. Hmm. Okay, so let's draw a card. That is not a good card. Uh, not for the moment, anyway. So we're going past turn. We're we're really lacking options right now. I guess I could have dropped this. I need to drop this. I, I need to quit holding on to it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, wind fury. That is possibly going to be very helpful soon. See how my uh, my buttons are misclicking here? That's not how they're supposed to be acting. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. What do we got? Swap stats with a friendly minion. That is a little bit helpful, but not that much. All right, come on here. All right, so hopefully we'll be. Oh no! Well, that's not too bad. Secrets cost zero. Uh, this is not good. Not good, guys. A random mage spell. <sighs> Depending on the spell that we get, let's go ahead and see what we pull. Okay. That is actually pretty good because of the mana situation that we're in right now. So let's go ahead and drop that. Um, and then we are going to... Wind Fury. Yeah, let's go ahead and drop that too. Alright, we've been needing to play that anyway, so. But yeah, rip videos coming up hopefully. Um, I'm also thinking about adding some mobile games to the videos, uh, such as. Um, such as I've been playing Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. I've been playing, uh, oh, that really sucked. I've been playing, um, oh, what do we want to do here? Oh, we can Nefarian now. No, bad luck, bad luck. Okay, so uh, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes I've been playing. I've been playing more Evil Bane, if you guys remember the videos on that. Um, also, I've been playing a little bit of Marvel Contest of Champions. Uh, Seton has basically quit making Rift content altogether and just been doing Marvel Contest of Champions because it's so good. I mean, there's almost no reason not to. He's doing so well with it. Okay. Let's see here. I wonder if he has a freezing trap. I wonder. Let's see here. 
Okay. My eyes are open. Um, and then we're going to uh, all right. That was making me nervous because my mouse was actually clicking the wrong areas right there. So, uh, I got the mobile games that I'm wanting to add, and uh, that would be pretty cool. But I've also been tinkering around with the idea of actually doing a Star Wars channel, specifically Star Wars. I thought it'd be really, really cool because um, I've been thinking about playing, uh, let's see here, uh, two minutes. Let's see here. Okay. We are going to. Of course. Um, let's go ahead and do that. Let's do that. And that's game, guys. Nice. I almost missed Lethal because I was actually getting a little sidetracked trying to talk. But, um, yeah, I got the mobile games I'm thinking about adding, but I'm also thinking about doing, like, my secondary channel or else a different channel that's going to be all Star Wars themed. Because I've been playing Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes on my phone. I've been wanting to play uh, some Star Wars The Old Republic uh, on my uh, on the computer, on the MMO. I thought all Star Wars themed channel would be really cool. I'm not like an expert on Star Wars, but I'm a big fan of it. So a channel like that may be pretty cool. I don't know. What do you guys think? I'm sure the Star Wars fans would be interested in that, but then everybody that isn't Star Wars fans is probably going to be like, Grim, just make rip videos, man. Um, but rip videos isn't really the way to go on uh, growing a channel because as you guys have noticed my channel has pretty much grown stagnant even uh, whenever I'm making a lot of content um, because uh, it's pretty much as big as a rift channel is going to get uh, for the most part unless I start doing a bunch of other content um, but somebody like Seton, he's completely gotten away from Rift content and went with like Marvel Contest of Champions and his channel has blown up like 5,000 subscribers more than what it was previously or 4,000 or something like that. Uh, all because he's making different content than Rift. So uh, we may keep this channel just uh, pretty much primary, uh, well we're always going to have it primarily uh, Rift, but the Star Wars stuff may go on a different channel. I'm not too sure. Or I may just add some of the mobile games onto this channel in addition to the Rift content. I don't know. Kind of sound off in the in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, we'll see what all comes up. I appreciate the support everybody. And like I said, hopefully more content will be coming out real soon. After I get settled in and get everything moved around the way it needs to be. As usual guys, my name is Grim. And I'll see you next time.